Hey there, collectives, and welcome back for a collective general love reading, honey. And it is absolutely amazing. So shout out to all of you beautiful, amazing people of the internet world. I hope the universe is tremendously edifying your soul so that you can live purposefully on this journey. So check it out, y'all. It is a general, so it's not going to resonate for every beautiful soul that views this content. But if it does resonate, I ask that you please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Also, for the collective, I do have a discount code if you're interested in beautiful, authentic crystal uh, jewelry. Uh, you can use my discount code. The name of the shop is uh, Outer Spirit. And they have every zodiac sign crystal. They have every crystal for every chakra in your body. If you're trying to manifest, shock, uh, crystals are very, very good, especially jewelry, especially when you um, activate them. Uh, you know, like the crystals come from the world. They come from the earth. And we're so connected because we're part of the earth. So if you want to tap into your, your spiritual power, I suggest uh, crystals, uh, especially jewelry, because they're so beautiful. So check out the description box below for your 20% off and for the link to Outer Spirit. Now check it out. I feel like what's going on here is these men won't love, honey. You got your overall energy. It's the man holding the heart. It's almost like somebody saying, uh, duh, uh, I got this heart. I was just saying, uh, duh, duh, I don't, I'm not doing nothing with it and everything. I was just, uh, duh, just, just saying and things that maybe, uh, maybe, uh, you want it. I mean, I don't, I got it. I'm just saying, I ain't doing nothing with it and everything. I was just, just saying, duh, do you want it? <laughs> I feel like. What I'm getting here is these masculines here, because it is a man holding a, a heart. We know that there is a woman holding a heart, too, but we ain't talking about the woman. We're talking about the man, all right? These men are ready for real, authentic love. They're, they're ready. These men are becoming emotionally vulnerable because, you know... It's just like with the female as well as the men, you have to be balanced in your yin yang energy, the masculine as well as the feminine. You can't be too overly masculine. You have to know how to adapt to every situation, especially when it comes to love. So I feel like these masculines have had a problem being vulnerable with love because it's like men are, uh, can conquer the world with everything else. But when it comes to being vulnerable with love, because. I'm starting to see that men are just as affected as the feminines are with love because no one wants to be hurt. No one wants to be played. But um, you're going to have to take a chance just like you take a chance with everything else. You're going to have to take a chance and just hope for the best. For some of you guys, somebody here has really been um, staying to themselves. And it could have been somebody here who had, you know, had distanced themselves from love or connections here. But I feel like someone has been doing a lot of work behind the scenes, rest and rejuvenation. Someone is re re rejuvenating their souls. But at the same time, I feel like somebody feels like they're missing something. They're missing love. And somebody may feel like that's what they hard needs. They, they hard needs to be rejuvenated. All right. <laughs> Somebody say, I got this hard here, but it don't feel, it don't feel heavy. It just feel like it's light. I need it to be filled up. Somebody, somebody heart needs to be rejuvenated. Um, but the only way it's going to be rejuvenated is in some type of connection because the next connection is caring. The next card is caring connection. See, somebody ready for love, honey. When I tell you they ready for this here love, they ready for it. And you know, they're being uh, enlightened here. Look, there go the sun card here. See, somebody is in love and ready for a real connection. And these masculines, they are opening up to you. So I'm saying if you were in a situation and for you masculines here, I feel like if you are really ready for love, you have a real deep caring connection that is here for you, especially with the sun card. So there is an opportunity to start completely over new beginnings, optimism, happiness, joy, abundance, um, this is your overall energy. The sun is shining on you for growth. I feel like if you have been in a connection with a masculine that they've been kind of detached or distanced, they they've been doing a lot of inner work behind the scenes. And this could have been somebody you taking a break from. But little do you know, behind the scenes, they've been working on themselves. These masculines are preparing for these soul connections here. And I feel like they ready for love, y'all. So that's what it is. All right. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see. They finally ready for love, y'all. They, they're no match. 
these masculines are in no match for love because somebody's realizing that they could have all the money and all the success in the world, but it don't mean nothing if you don't have anyone to share it with. Everybody wants somebody to share life with. I was thinking about my um my homeboy. I got to call him my homeboy, but he's kind of like a kindred spirit. As well as my homegirl. People that I used to work with back when I was like 22 or 23 years old, y'all, we didn't get back in contact and we all old. <laughs> old now we all old now god dang it <laughs> but my masculine friend be sharing his life stories with me and all the stuff he going through and how his body tired but how he's so thankful and all those things like that and I'm so impressed and so proud of them because a lot of people that he's discussing they're not here with us today but it's like this it's like it's like when you get older the things that you thought mattered in the past it really doesn't matter you're just looking for somebody to be consistent and loyal to you because if you're not on the same accord, then why even bother? Because you're going to always find somebody in this big old world that's going to match your vibration. I feel like if you if you ain't ish, you need to stay on the ain't ish side. All right. Don't come to the is ish side and try to <laughs> disrupt us. I'm just saying. So like I say, I feel like these masculines are realizing that the very thing that they shunned and tried to deny and run from is the very thing that they so desperately yearns and desires and needs now. All right. So, so this, this is how you're starting your energy off here. Somebody, somebody, somebody say, you know what? Ordinarily, I wouldn't be showing my feelings like this. But the way that you are, the way that you carry yourself, the energy that you exuberate, everything about your essence is making me drawn to you. Could it be I'm thought somebody may be falling in love with you, honey, because you've got the freaking Empress card and because you are doing very, very good on your own. So somebody say, you know what, if I get it hard to anybody, but once again, you, you could be kind of intimidating to them, too. Could be a Leo, but they coming. Somebody say, you know what? I think so highly of you that I want to make an offer here. See, Knight of Pentacles, the Eight of Wands. I feel like somebody here who once was stuck or who once was afraid of love and life is somebody here who is opening up to it. But like, I feel like somebody's looking at you like, like they're intimidated. See, they go to Seven of Pentacles and they go to freaking Two of Cups and the Magician card. And look, they go to Sun card again. See? Somebody say, you know what? I ordinarily don't give my heart out, but for you, see, I told you, see, look at them. See there? So you y'all got somebody going crazy or somebody here who is smitten by you. Like I said, it could be a formal connection because you have a caring connection. Look, that go the sun card, see? The magician, somebody, somebody is watching you, collective. Somebody watching you while they all in their heart and soul. Somebody want to offer you that love. Ooh, look at the leaves. See? So this reminds me of fall when the leaves are changing colors and dropping. I feel like this is what's, look, they go a hard space right there. Look at that. This person got love all on the dome. See? They got love all on the brain, see? And it's about you because you're different. But you can be very, very intimidating to this person here. I feel like for some of y'all, it's somebody that you already know because that's why you got rest and rejuvenate. This could have been somebody that you've taken a break from and now that they didn't did some inner work, now, now they ready. It could be somebody that you don't know that's been keeping tabs on you, but they know that they needed to work on themselves. Because you definitely have a caring connection with the sun card, so you know it's going to be good. Somebody wants to shower you with gifts. You know they're going to put their work in. You got the Knight of Pentacles here. See? Ooh. -wee. So let's clarify. This is good. The man holding the heart. Could have been the man holding the coin, but now it's the man holding the heart. So this could be somebody here who... Like I keep on getting it, they go to page of source again. Somebody's been studying you and observing, observing you. And somebody feels drawn to you, especially with this two of cups and the magician card. Somebody said that they are hopelessly, helplessly under your spell, honey, with this magician card and the page of source. It could be somebody who checked your, checked your, um, 
your profile out online and they they can't they ain't been able to look away ever since and it could be somebody that you've been involved with but you guys have taken a break or you're in separation and you're the only thing that they're thinking about somebody won't love somebody say you're worthy you're worthy of everything so let's see don't forget to thumbs up this video leave me a high vibrational comment and let's see what's going on with these masculines. But you know what? I'm getting divine masculine and divine feminine because the emperor showed up and you got that masculine right there. For some of you guys, it could be somebody younger than you. So let's see. Let's start off with this page of swords. Why is the page of swords here for the collective today? Somebody is studying you, someone asking around about you. Somebody may be trying to see whether or not you're single or not because you do have the nine of pentacles. So somebody may be asking somebody that you guys have a mutual connection with. Somebody could be on the job saying, God dang, I know you, man. I know you got, I know you got to have somebody. <laughs> somebody holding, crossing their fingers. Please be single. Please, please, please be single. Mm. Page of swords. Why is the past? I know you ain't single with that empress. <laughs> Page of Swords. What's up with the Page of Swords? Clarify the Page of Swords for the collective. Why is this here? Page of Swords. Ooh, the Hierophant. This could be somebody checking you out from a business or job or somebody praying that you single. Because somebody said that they can see themselves settling down with you, see? And that go to Magician card, see? You got the two of cups and the magician card again. See, like I said, somebody said, you know what? I ordinarily don't show my heart, but for you, baby, I give it to you. Somebody said you can get it. Could be a Taurus, a Pisces. Why is the page of swords here for the collective? See, mm. the king of cups. See, that, that a man is holding the heart, but I told you, see. There they go. There they go right there. See? Ooh. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Somebody say, you know what? I'm going to give my heart to you. See, this person said that they don't want to be no player no more. They ready to change their ways. See? See? There they go. Somebody said they used to love them and leave them. That was my plain fame to claim. Fire and desire, baby. Then I laid eyes on you. It was pain before pleasure. Woo, that's what they see. Ooh, why is the two of cups here? See? Somebody said they used to be a player till they laid eyes on you. They said that changed everything. They said they didn't even know they made you like that. <laughs> they thought they started making you out in the 70s. They thought, they thought that folks like you went out in the 70s. God dang it. <laughs> Look. Page of Cups. Ooh. The lovers. Check it out, mama. Daddy. The emperor. See? Ooh. See? See, 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 you got the lover. See, somebody say, you know what, little mama, I do everything for you. I promise for I do it all. They go to star cards. See, like I said, somebody's looking at you saying, dang, man, I, 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 I thought I didn't want love <laughs> until I laid eyes on you. And you got somebody rethinking this love thing. Now, why is the magician here again? It's a love thing. A love, love thing, love thing. Clarify the magician. Just seeing the devil. Ooh, Capricorn energy. Manifesting. Ooh, they go to Queen of Pentacles. See how they see you, collective? They see you as marriage material. They feel like you're the one here. You're the one that can make them complete. Somebody said that they got everything in the world. The only thing they're missing is you. Ooh, so they said they really ain't got nothing there. Ooh, the magician. Somebody say you bad and you booze or you the type of person. That they feel like they got to spoil. They say you ain't going to have to worry about a god dang thing. And they go to three of Pentacles here. See, somebody's looking for somebody that they can build a partnership with. See, and there go the wheel of fortune. Something is coming back around. Somebody's coming in with a whole relationship, a whole commitment. Somebody made up in their mind that they need love. See the will of, I mean, the judgment and the ace of wands. See, 
Now, what's up with this Empress for the collective? What is this about? The Empress. Libra energy. What's up with the Empress? Libra energy. What's up with the Empress? Mm, justice. Could be a Libra. There is somebody trying to go under contract with you. Somebody wants you bound to them by law. <laughs> Somebody wants you bound by law, god dang it. They say, look, you can't just go nowhere because we got papers. Somebody said, it. somebody want papers on you. Ooh, <laughs> see, somebody want papers on you. Y'all remember, y'all remember, y'all remember that song by Dimples? She's got paper. Y'all remember Dimples? Look, Ten of Cups, there it is, see. Somebody say, look here, I, I, I can't talk to you because this how I don't even belong to me. This how I belong to the collective. Well, you should have met me a couple of years ago. Ooh, and that go to freaking 10. Ooh, we. I say, ooh, we child, yeah. That go to Six of Pentacles, too, see? Somebody say, you got papers on them, Scorpios, or they want papers on you so that you always be there. Mm. Now, what's up with the Nine of Pentacles for Scorpios? Independent, a life of luxury. Somebody say, yeah, little mama, I already know you're doing your thing. I see you doing your thing with the page of sword, but I'm just saying, I'm just trying to make it better for you. Ooh, see? Somebody say, somebody say, that's why I do want you, because I see you doing your thing. And when I tell you this person is into you, they're so into you. They don't know what they're going to do. Because they care for you. Look, y'all, don't come for me because I sang. That's, that's what I feel. Like I said, this person has been obsessing about this for a very, very long time. Somebody could be obsessing about whether or not you're single. For some of y'all guys, so for somebody, this could, this could be a celebrity type of energy. The Nine of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, the Devil. And they go to... Uh, the judgment and the ace of wands again. But I feel like they got it bad against you. They're watching you. They're obsessing over you. Somebody's obsessing over you, Scorpio, because they done made up in their mind that you're the one. And for some of y'all, it could actually be someone that you know. But like I say, you coming off as very, very intimidating because you're the empress with the nine of pentacles. But you see how they see See, you as the queen of pentacles here. Somebody, ooh, Scorpio, somebody say, you know what I worked. Somebody said that they'll work, they'll work, work this connection like a job. <laughs> oh, but even though, even though they may be an emperor, they may be a boss. It's almost like this song. No matter how high, no matter how high I get. I still be looking up to you. That's what they say. They say, baby, I got all the riches in the world, but I still feel small in comparison to you. Ooh. Now, why I strength here? It could be a Leo. <laughs> Shout out to the Leos celebrating their birthday. Y'all going to get your shine on mommy, poppy, because y'all time almost up. God dang it. And then we're going to be in Virgo season. No shade, but it's the truth. All right. Shout out to you, Leos. So somebody here is trying to stand in their power, their courage, and come to you here. But like, I feel like you're intimidating to this person, the five of pentacles in the reverse. And the reason why you intimidating to this person, because this person wants to, this person wants your love back. It's so good, good, good. Loving somebody when somebody loves you back. Not talking about the 7 to 30. See, this person looking for somebody who's going to reciprocate the love. See? See? That's why you got justice right next to the empress. They say, look, I know how I feel, but do you feel the same? Tell me if you still care about me. Now, if there's somebody from your past, now that they done been rejuvenated and everything, they want to know, do you used to love me? Do you still love me? Because I'm ready. Somebody say, I want to give you everything that you wanted in the past. I'm ready to give it to you now if it ain't too late.
Somebody wide open, though, Scorpio. I mean, I said Scorpio. Could be a Scorpio. Somebody is wide open for you, see? And now all the things they did not do in the past, they're going to make the exception to the rule because, like they said, they're infatuated with you. Knight of Pentacles, somebody ready for love. These masculines is ready to be pampered in love, and they ready to, see? Knight of Pentacles, four ones. Somebody is coming out of indecisions and um, uh, denial. Somebody probably thought that because they was a boss that they didn't need nobody. Somebody's realizing they ain't got nothing without you or without the right connection here. See, could be a cancer for some of y'all. The cherry, somebody wants to succeed. Somebody said that they're going to get you because you got the magician card here. See, and like I said, for some of y'all, and don't come for the messenger because I am just a reader. You got the six of cups. See. So once again, most of y'all soulmates are having this rejuvenation to their soul. They're being enlightened. They're waking up, especially for the masculine. It's about the masculine because you already know most of the feminine, they're already ready for you. That they've always been ready. It's just that it wasn't reciprocated. It was one sided. I'm so tired of these spam calls. They call you like y'all know each other and stuff like like we kicked it or something. I feel like y'all, this is some energy from your past and they've undergone a major transformation in their life. And somebody's realizing that being alone and being guarded sucks. Page of Pentacles here, see? So somebody's coming in with some good news. Somebody wants to tell you something. <laughs> Oh, they go to nine of cups. I feel like somebody trying to come make you an offer. They hope you don't refuse. And I feel like this is somebody you that you took a time out with because you got rest and rejuvenation here. Some of y'all laid this to rest. So you took some time out from this connection. And now somebody is hoping that y'all can renew this, but make it better. Somebody's hoping you don't reject them, though, because they go to page of swords and the four of cups because somebody's intimidated by you. Somebody say, how do you convince somebody that has everything? Somebody ain't never met somebody like you, Scorpio, because they see themselves as the emperor, but they see you as the empress. They coming off as the king of pentacles, but they also see you as their queen of pentacles. They see you as the queen of cups. And for some of y'all, if this is a past relationship, they are the king of cups for you. They're in love. Seven of pentacles. Now, somebody has been waiting a long time or maybe they had you waiting, but somebody is ready to plant the right seeds in order to grow something that's going to last because you got the 10, 10, 10 of cups, 10 of pentacles, ace of wands, ace of pentacles, ace of cups. You got all the opportunities in the world to experience real love with the soulmate. Knight of swords. Somebody is so anxious. Somebody's about to take action towards you and totally surprise you. Because for some of y'all, you probably had no idea that this person was so in love with you or that this person has been going through a major transformation. Page of one. See, see, they're coming small because, like I say, they scared that you may re reject them. And I feel like somebody don't want you to reject them. But I feel like somebody's trying to prepare themselves because they go to seven one because they're not going to back down. Somebody with this courage card is finally going to face their fears with their emotions and they're going to open up to you. So tonight I give the end to the feeling collective. You're everything. Somebody about to somebody came into my life and it feels just fine. They go to Ace of Swords. See there? Somebody is realizing that they do not want to miss out on this and they would do anything just to win your love because they got a lot of love to give you to these masculines are hungry for love your love empress all right that's your today's collective message for today's your masculines is in need of love their feminines love and they're coming in with it so please like share and subscribe bye